Morning, welcome to another video. Hope you're all safe and well. Uh, in the last one, we got that four in on the front, uh, but we haven't managed to weld it all the way around because some of this needs cutting out and replacing first. So today, we're going to look at this inner wing panel. We're going to cut this off, clean it up, and see just exactly how much we need to replace. So let's crack on. First thing to do is get rid of this old closing panel. We'll have a new one in there later. We're going to use this new scuttle panel to measure and mark where we need to cut the last remaining bit of the old scuttle. Well that were harder than it should have been, but it's off now and not looking too bad under there. Right, so before we carry on, we're going to take this lip off, we're going to cut this bit out of the way and then we can place our panel on that section and work out where we need to cut it from there. This bit itself is solid. Do that then. Built it up later on, we've measured and checked exactly where we need to be. I'm going to take this off now, trim the edge, not right up to the line, I'm going to trim the edge because at the moment it's being held out by the nuts on the air vent. Uh, we're then going to fit it back on and whilst it's bolted in position, I'm going to cut to the line through both panels with the thin disc. So let's get on with that. Thank you. 
So, just to make sure that we get everything in the right place, we've made a template, as you can see, and that just slots into the bolt holes. That when we bolt this on, it's exactly in the right place. Of course, what that means is that when this is welded on, we can then put it through from the other side and make sure that these panels are exactly in the right place. So that's coming really handy. What we're going to do now is we're going to measure the edge of this, we're going to mark the edge of this panel, and then we're going to cut the inside bit a lot narrower and get rid of the excess before we weld this in, before we cut this up. We've got a few spot welds to get rid of now. We decided it fits so well where it is, we're just going to cut straight down this edge.
there you go, one flitch panel ready for welding. Well now that's on, we need to do a bit of work on the pillar. So we're going to leave that there for now and we'll see you all next time. Thanks again for watching, bye for now.